hey 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 Aquarius this is your sacred scribe here ready to do your reading so this is going to be a reading for my Aquas Sun Moon Rising Venus Jupiter and North Node this will not resonate with everybody of course but hopefully it will with you please don't forget to like share and subscribe right down below there Aquarius if you would before you leave I do appreciate it and thank you so much for all of your likes, shares and subscriptions. If you guys are interested in a personal reading, that way this is more specific to you and your questions and your needs, information can be found in the description box below. Make sure that you're utilizing that link as there are scammers about the community and know that you will always see my face in a reading as well as receive an unlisted link that you can utilize forever here on YouTube. Don't forget to comment. I want to hear from you guys and hit that notification bell. That way you get notified whenever I upload a video or go live. All right. So Aquarius, your overall energy is the page of wands. You have the judgment card. You have the nine of wands, the ten of wands and the five of swords here. So something's weighing heavy on you. This could be work overload, I'm hearing. If a lot of you are working, you know, extremely hard right now. I feel you're guarded in love. But I also feel you have an upbeat attitude here. And you're, you're trying to take care of yourself and take care of your spirituality as well now what's going on with this battle i feel there's drama going on around you it could be at work right it's my frenemies card but it's a battle not worth fighting so let's see what's going on tell me about the page of wands the emperor aries energy here the full moon, the new moon, oh, uh, that's why, and the six of moons. I feel like you're trying to complete something and it may be a project at work because you want to start, you want to have this new beginning. I do feel this new beginning is in love. I feel that you, you feel you can't go after love until this is complete. Uh, maybe you feel like you don't have enough time right now. So you're overworking or you will be overworking to fulfill that, you know, dream, I guess. So let's see. Let me get a kipper here. Let's get a kipper on this. So I do see you as the emperor mature man and I feel like that's you whether you're male or female and it doesn't mean you're old it means that you're just mature you're stepping into this emperor like role and taking control of your direction and you have a plan Stan you have a plan and you're thinking about love you're reminiscing on the feelings of love the those sweet feelings of love i feel your attitude is upbeat but you are working hard you're working hard and to balance that you're trying to uh, feed your spiritual side maybe with meditation etc but you have to ignore this drama that is going on around you now they may see that you're happy and that bugs them because you're lighting up and you're lighting something within them that they don't want to look at so let's see judgment king of stars taurus energy the knight of swords uh, you're getting messages from the spirit here and the five of moons okay I feel your past experiences in love, okay? I feel like you've come to terms with it. 
you're no longer sad or grieving about love you're understanding the wisdom and the lessons that you can extract from that love experience or those love experiences you're getting messages from spirit regarding your stability and you may even be doing this work thing because it, there's something spirit told you pay attention to your stability because love is coming in it's it's like they want to prepare you for this love so it, i feel you may be doing exactly what you're told whether this be subconscious or so we have mature woman interesting because we have mature man so somebody's going to act uh, match your energy here we do have concern so I feel this concern may be related to this five of moons here but I do feel that you will come out of this ah okay the Empress so you're the Emperor over here right male or female doesn't matter so you're I feel going to be worried not extremely that you don't find your empress but you will you've got the mature woman in the mature man so you're matching your vibration you will find exactly what you're looking for and spirits trying to encourage you okay to look forward to that instead of being worried about that okay all right so tell me about the nine of wands you've got to trust in the universe trust in your belief in what is meant for you what is meant for you will always find you so even if this five of swords energy you know attempts to keep you from it it's just not going to happen you're, you're dealing with spirit it, they're not going to win so you got page of swords and ten of moons clarifying the nine of wands here yeah see this happiness i feel ah uh, aquarius you're really looking within and you're looking at your wounds and you're shifting this energy and transmuting this energy into the ten of cups into emotional fulfillment because all these nine all these wounds okay that you've experienced by extracting the wisdom you gain the happiness you gain that emotional fulfillment you're filling your own cup and because you're filling that that's exactly what you're attracting somebody else who has done the same thing transformation death and that is awesome that is awesome community i feel like you're doing your part as well you're very connected to those around you you're very in tune because you're in tune with yourself tell me about the ten of wands you may be even noticed for something you're doing in work so we have the three of pentacles yeah because you're collaborating the six of stars you're juggling a cup you may even have two jobs with the six of stars because that's my card for juggling people or things and i know it's not people because you're preparing yourself for this person the ace of moons here yeah see you're preparing for this new love and you're trying to balance your life and yourself to prepare for this new love and that's beautiful because I feel they're doing the same thing they're mirroring you yeah you're raising your vibration you don't want it to affect you negatively so I also feel why this is um you're so positive this is in the back of your head I feel that this bad health may have happened in this five of cups relationship here as you look back I feel that you're realizing that the emotions that you were feeling and that maybe you were harboring within this union manifested itself in in your body right and uh, that's how it revealed itself so you're shifting that perspective and saying no I want this I want high honor I want that positivity so that way I'm receiving it tell me about the five of swords 
tell me about the five of swords who are these people tell me about the five of swords Ooh, the lovers Ooh, these people are jealous when this person comes in the high priestess somebody and the magician be careful you need to keep your your lover is coming in your emperor or empress is coming in okay and you need to keep this secret because you have people around you uh one if not more that is very interested in you in a love situation and i don't think you're interested you want to manifest your counterpart here but they will try to sabotage anything that you're trying to create so you need to keep it on the down low on the hush hush because it's a very strong connection and it's a very high vibrational connection here yeah great fortune so say nothing it is a gift from the universe all right so let's get your advice oh my gosh ten of stars which is ten of pentacles ace of swords and ace of stars so spirit saying remain in clarity take the opportunity and love when it when it meets you and it will meet you and you're meant for this uh, commitment you're meant for this possible marriage you're meant to come together with this person so they want you to continue to hold that energy and you will you are that's what I'm reading here and the, the potential in this energy is here okay so if you're saying well that's not how I feel now know that the potential is here grab it take hold of it okay all right so advice for Aquarius fear if you want to be free of fears and phobias then you have to understand why they exist and make peace with them okay so just as you're looking at your you know sadness revolving around past love relationships look at the fears associated with them okay it may take you even deeper okay all right, Aquarius, I hope that resonates. Please drop a like below, share, and subscribe if you already haven't. If you're interested in a personal reading, that way this is more specific to you and your questions and your needs. Information can be found in the description box below. Make sure that you're utilizing uh, that link as there are scammers about the community and know that you will always see my face in a reading as well as receive an unlisted link that you can utilize forever here on YouTube. Don't forget to comment. I want to hear from you guys and hit that notification bell. That way you get notified whenever I upload my videos or go live. Have a fabulous day and I will catch you on the flip side on the dailies. Namaste.